hey guys welcome back to the channel in today's tutorial video i'm going to show you how to create an account on the kraken app the process is really easy i'll show you how stay with me let's get started before that be sure you've installed the kraken app on your phone now let's get to the point so first of all open the kraken app on your phone you'll see this space on your screen now to sign up for an account you'll have to tap on create account and enter your credentials here enter your email address with which you want to create the account I'll type my address real quick. After you're done, tap on next. On this page, you'll have to create a username. Be sure that it's unique and it should be at least five characters long. And after you're done, tap on next. And here you'll have to create a unique password. So do that, create a strong one. If you don't want to create a password by yourself, then you can tap on the generate a password option. And when you create a password, be sure it meets all the requirements listed below. After you're done, press next. Here you'll have to enter your country of residence. And after you're done, tap on create account. And here you'll have to activate your account. For that, you'll have to open the link sent on your email address by the app. On your email address, you'll see this kind of mail sent by Kraken. Here you can either tap on activate account or just copy this activation code on previous page. So type your code here and then press next. Let it load. And as you can see, your account has been activated. Now all you have to do is verify your identity. So tap on next. Select your country code from here and then type your mobile number on this box. After you're done, press next. Now enter your legal name on these boxes. This name should be your legal name on cards like passport and citizenship. After that, press next. And here you'll have to enter your date of birth. So tap on the box and slide through these options to select your date of birth. Then tap confirm. And here tap next. On this page, you'll have to enter your primary address, so do that. Then tap on next. Now choose your occupation from this list. I'll just choose student. Let it load. And here you'll have to verify your identity with a photo ID. You can either use your national ID, passport or your driver's license. So tap on any option that's convenient for you. And here tap on allow. Now all you have to do is place your ID on a flat surface and capture a picture of your ID. You have to make sure that all the text and corners of the ID are visible. Also, the ID shouldn't be expired. After you submit your ID, you'll be asked to prove your residence. So for that, you can either use your utility bill or your bank statement or credit card statement and even your proof of residence certificate. So capture a picture of the document that's the most convenient for you and upload it. Just like you uploaded the national ID before. Before. After that, your identity will have been confirmed and you can start using the app. This is it for the tutorial. I hope it was helpful and don't forget to like the video and stay tuned for further tutorials. Thank you.